It's all about the noodles, bitch. I've got to admit, man, if you're a fan of noodles, got to try these bad boys. They are good. If you're vegetarian, they might not be good because it doesn't state whether they're vegetarian or not. Who knows? It's got pictures of chicken on. It might not be. But it's dank as shit. My days. But we're not here today to talk about noodles. We're not here to talk. We're not here to talk about noodles. We're here to talk about this new book, man. A noodle just shut out. I know we're a bit behind here. We're a bit behind on schedule. I know it's been out for a while. I haven't been making videos for a while. What are you going to do about it? Are you going to punch me? Do you think you're a big man? Are you going to hit me right now? You aren't going to hit me for shit. You're not going to hit me. We're here to talk about Fifty Shades of Motherfucking Gay. Now, I don't even know where to begin with this. Let me have one last bite. Let me have one last bite of noodles and then we'll get onto this. Mmm, mmm, too good. So yeah, we're here to talk about Fifty Shades of Gay. Basically, there's some crusty ass new book out, man. Well, I don't even know if it's new. But people have been getting on some mad hype. Now, this is the front cover of it. Fifty Shades of Gay. Eat it, you ho. Now, already, this looks intriguing to me. This makes me want to read this book. You know, it, it looks it looks good. You know, you, you've got lots of pages, lots of pictures and stuff. It looks quite good, man. You know, so I'm going to probably give it a read still, either way, after slagging it off. But yeah, I'm not so much pissed off at the book itself. Now, I don't even know what it's about yet. I haven't got around to reading it yet. I, pro I probably won't, man. I'll probably burn this copy or sell it afterwards on eBay or some shit for like £40,000. Because that seems to be what people are paying for these goddamn books. But yeah, I guess it's just a book about some guy that's fucking bitches. Now, in a way, it's porn, isn't it? It's like reading porn. Now, I just want to start off and say, if you think you're a big man because you're reading a book about porn, you're a fucking retard. You know the internet's been invented for about 64 years now. You know it's been there for about 64 years. And each, oh God, each year, more porn gets added onto it. Now, I don't watch porn. I, I, I was just about to say I have a woman. I don't as such have a woman yet. But I'm getting there. I'm getting there. So, I don't need the pornography. Some people out there need pornography. Clearly, you guys reading a book about a man having sex with a woman needs to bring, needs to watch some pornography. Or you haven't discovered pornography yet. I don't know whether you're living in the Stone Ages, man. Are you living in a tent in a field somewhere and all you've got is a packet of rice and this book, Fifty Shades of Gay? You know, and then I could understand why you're reading it, but I don't know why you're getting turned on by a crusty-ass book. Whack on some porn, go on ugis.com, put in big booty bitches, and then you'll see that you'll be happy. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, more than anything, it's not the fact of that, it's just the fact that everybody... I'm sick of these people that jump on the bandwagon. Do you know what I mean? Oh! Have you read this book? No, I haven't. This, that's alright, recommending it. But before you know it, every bitch out there is reading this goddamn thing. Now, some of you I haven't got a problem with, so I don't want to offend people that I know that are reading it, you know... Because at the end of the day, you, you know, you might not read it, you might not read very often, and then all of a sudden you want to read it. That's, that's, that, I don't know, I'm just going going back on what I'm about to say, but I don't want you to be offended. We're all here for jest, and we? We're all here for jokes. Not really, I hate you. Um, more to do with people that I fucking went to school with. I'm sitting on Facebook, I'm saying, I just read 50 Fades of Grey. I just read the second page. You fucking retard. In school, you didn't even know where you were half the time. Walking around, what am I doing today? Am I sucking a dick today? Or am I going to go and get some dinner? Do you know what I mean? Shall I go to the, can I go to the sweet shop and get a can of cola? I don't know. Do you know what I mean? You never did shit all at school. So just because everybody else is reading some goddamn book. Goddamn book. Don't bother reading it. You know I would have probably read this book. Not really, but I probably would have read this book. But I'm not going to read it now because everybody else has read it. I read Lord of the Rings before it was even written. Do you know how? I was friends with J.R.R. Motherfucking... <laughs> J.R.R. Motherfucking Tolkien, man. I used to chill with him. I used to be at his crib saying, Look, man, Tolkien, what are you doing today? He's like, oh, I've just finished The Hobbit. And I said, mate, I, I read that ages ago. He's like, oh, did you read it? I didn't even finish it. I said, mate, we're connected. We're blood brothers. I know what's coming down. I helped him write it, basically. I helped write Lord of the Rings. I helped write that. No biggie. No biggie. I'd say I helped write in Harry Potter, man, but I fucking hate that four-eyed prick. So, yeah. 
I don't know, man, it just pisses me the F off. Can't you just go to a bookshop, look round, and find a book that looks good to you, and just start reading that motherfucking piece of shit, instead of going, oh, well, my nan's been reading Fifty Shades of Gay. My nan's been reading Fifty Shades of Gay, so I'm going to read Fifty Shades of Gay. Oh, my uncle's been reading Fifty Shades of Gay, so I'm going to read Fifty Shades of Gay. Oh, my great grand who's dead is reading Fifty Shades of Grey. I'm going to read Fifty Shades of Grey. Fuck you and Fifty Shades of Grey. I'm not interested in your Fifty Shades of Gay. Oh, my God. You know what? I lied to you all. This isn't what the book's called. It's actually called Fifty Shades of Grey. I accidentally said it a couple of times. This is my version. Fifty Shades of Gay. You know what I mean? And that is basically... The picture on the front is supposed to be... A man jizzing on a man. But I decided to have the man have big titties with black nipples. I know women have titties, but some men have titties like me. They are big and voluptuous. I would also like to lick that nipple. But who knows? Eat it, you ho. I don't know, man. I'm just sick of it. I'm sick of everybody jumping on the bandwagon for things. Can't you just do something because you want to do it? Can't you do something because you enjoy it? Can't you find something yourself? Do you know what I mean? I'm fucking sick of everything, man. Starting to get sick of breathing because everybody does it. So I just sit at home and eat noodles, man. I haven't got any qualms for you reading Fifty Shades of Grey. It's a book, man. It's a book, you know. I'm not going to be angry at you for reading the book. Do what you want to do. More than anything, I'm just angry at retards and chavs and mongols that never read. Never read. But they're just doing it because everybody else is doing it. Fuck you. You know you've wasted your money because you don't even know how to read. You think you're reading, but you don't know how to read. You think you're reading, but you don't know how. You know about four words. Knife and fuck. Marijuana. That's all you know. So you're reading this book. Fuck and marijuana weed. Fucking marijuana boogity boogle. You know what I mean? Adding your own little jest into it. Come shot. Ooh, that's what you're reading. What's the point? What is the point? What's the point? I don't even know what my point is, really. This gets me angry as fuck, man. Ruined it for me, you have. I wanted to read this book, beat off. Beat myself off, silly man. But now I can't do that. Because everybody else is doing it. I'm not going to buy a second-hand copy. What if somebody's juiced all over the pages? You know, every now and again when you go to a library or you get a book or, I don't know, you get a leaflet or some shit like that and it's stuck together. Or a couple of times I've had a game and I've opened it and the, 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 you know, the manual inside is stuck on certain pages. What always scares me about Why is it stuck? Why is it stuck? Name a couple of things that could have got in there and made that, oh, made that stick. First thing that comes to mind is ejaculation fluid, man. You think I touch those manuals again? Never. Oh, I don't even know where I am, man. This noodle is too dang. Mm. And with that, I'm going to leave it, man. I'm going to just finish off these noodles. But if you read Fifty Shades of Gear, and you're a moron from my old school, or you're just a moron in general that never... If you've never read a book before, yeah? You've never read a book for fun before, and then all of a sudden you start reading, fuck you, you're an embarrassment... You're an absolute moron. And you know when you're on running me mad? You know when you're on Facebook posting these statuses? I just got Fifty Shades of Grey and I read the first page and I don't know what's happening yet because I don't really know how to read but I have enjoyed it. If you're one of those people that are doing that then fuck you. You see what I mean? I don't care. I don't care about your actions. I don't care about your boogers. I don't care about your nips. Ah. Oh. <sighs> yeah, fuck. Fifty Shades of Gay Fuck Fifty Shades of Gay It's not your fault that you're gay It's just natural selection